Wake up call, Nancy, May 5th, 2017, by Nancy Tate. Web page, Tree of the Golden Light. I want to begin this sharing message to you by telling you about a dream I had a couple nights ago. I had been tired and low feeling for the past few days. Then in the morning of May 3rd I woke up from a dream in which my dear friend, Ava was telling me how she has gotten her dream home that she has always wanted. I saw that she was there in it with her family, and the symbols of how it all came to her were at the bottom of the dream in a line that had just completed. Ava passed away last October. She had been living in Villa Cambomba the past three years. She told me that Bob and I won't have to die to be able to manifest our dream home. She wanted to let me know that we will be able to get our dream home before we ascend. The dream was all about saying that all the pieces will be put in place for the funds to come forward. She was so happy and smiling. It was a beautiful wake-up start of the day for me. I have felt so good since then. That is the first dream I have remembered having in many weeks. That evening Bob and I went to the place we go to enjoy the live music we love so much. Then suddenly, without my thinking of the possibility, I got the news that there is to come a huge turnaround, and things would all come into place for us all. It won't take long, for it is all in place. All day today I have felt to somehow bring this news to you. Then this afternoon I felt to go online to singsnap.com and record the song Imagine, by John Lennon. This evening I re-recorded the song because I knew it would be better than the first effort I did with it. I was so inspired to sing it and then to bring it forth to all of you. Then I immediately knew why. It was to be the opening for this message that I bring to you in the essence of the song. Imagine the time of oneness to be now and forevermore, for that is what it is. Imagine. I love you all. When it comes to the time when you are in a predicament where you don't know what to do, do what you feel good about doing. Do it for yourself and know that as you do, it will bring you to a place that you will be able to share with others who are involved. It is not a matter of putting yourself first, but in putting yourself in a place where you are combined with all of those who are with you, and involved in what you are planning to do. You are in the oneness of who is in the world and in the problematics that are clearing out, as you live each moment in the essence of love and community. When I say community, I say that we are all one, and as we go about our daily movements we include everyone else in them. Have you thought of this? Have you considered that in every moment you are bringing about the combination of who you are, and all of those who are with you in this world? It is a matter of living in the moment, in the love for everyone else, along with yourself. It is that simple, and it is that wonderful in a way to know that you are never alone. You are always in the company, in one way or another, of all of mankind and all of the life on earth. That includes the animals, the insects, the trojans, the trees, the flowers, the grasses, etc. It is all in our essence and we are all a part of living on this planet to become the oneness that we have destined ourselves for. It is the beginning of so many beginnings. It is the way to live our lives knowing that we are all together in the splendor of life and the love, that we feel for anything that is in our life stream of love and creation, for we have been a part of the creation of it all. Need I say more? I say that I love all of you, and in my imagination of what comes into my essence, you are all in the oneness of what I feel and live for all, evermore and completeness. Welcome to my moment of love with you all. On we go from here. Here is my singing of Imagine. Click here. Thank you dear John Lennon. I know you are in tune with what this means forevermore. Thank you all for who you are. Much love. Nancy Tate